If you're a parent, I suggest you look at YouTube Premium. It launched in the Middle East in September of 2019 and it costs 25 dirhams a month. What it does is uh, it removes the ads from the YouTube videos. So when your kids are going from one video to the other, they're not exposed to unnecessary ads. One thing I've, uh, I've been noticing that my kids now understand ads and they wait to skip and uh, they see ads that they're watching cartoons, they're, not, they're still used to animated uh, types of content. They're still not used a lot to the uh, human visual type of, uh, of content like ads or TV shows or movies like the adults watch. So uh, this is a way to, uh, to, reduce, uh, to reduce that and the interruptions that they have from that. It also supports uh, offline viewing. That means if you're going on a road trip uh, or a long flight, you can put the videos offline. I remember when uh, uh, my daughter was much, much younger and we had a long, it was her first flight with us. I had to struggle finding a tool that, uh, that does offline viewing of YouTube and uh, so this is easy, you just click on download, it downloads it and you have that. It also supports other things like background view, so if it's playing in the background and then if they click on the home button and then they're doing something else on the, uh, on the phone or tablet, uh, YouTube continues to play in the background. It also comes with a, a music app. So it's a dedicated music app. It has everything, it's not just for kids. So music app is similar to Anagami, Spotify, Apple Music, Deezer. So it has a wide variety of uh, different types of music. So that's where uh, you can benefit from this as well. So it's 25 dirhams, uh, it's not expensive. If you add another 10 dirhams, 36 dirhams, you can have five family accounts. So the mom, the dad, uh, if you have uh, two kids, each with their separate accounts or not, and they don't want to fight, and it's available in, in, in different countries in the Middle East.